Hi, my name is Ty. This is my channel. Um, today I'm doing a collective reading. Um, it may or may not resonate, but I hope y'all enjoy the video. It is my first time on YouTube doing tarot, so I hope y'all like it. And um, yeah. Okay, I don't already show for everything. I don't show for my tarot cards. I don't show for my oracles and my affirmations yeah and um i done already you know sprayed my area down and stuff so um i think i'm ready okay okay spirit what do the collective needs to know today the collective needs to know today we got the knight of pentacles Something about stability. Something about stability. Um, okay. Any other messages for the collective? We got the king of pentacles. Yes. Stability. Something about some money. And give me one more, please. And we got the four of swords. Um, being patient on something, relaxing, relaxing, resting. Um, some of y'all might be waiting on some money. Um, it's coming. You just gotta be patient and have trust. Cause we got the high fence at the bottom of the deck. Um, yeah. Let me look at, uh, I'm going to read it from the book as well. I mean, you know. Um, so, we got the Knight of Pentacles. The first card. And that stands for hard work. It say you have to be consistent consistent and committed to, she, to achieving your goals. Then we got the King of Pentacles. And that is a symbol of success and wealth. Uh, it also creates wealth for others. And financial wisdom. And the four swords. And that's a moment of rest and contemplation after the chaos of the three of swords. It encourages solitary reflections. So, yeah, okay, what is the Knight of Pentacles talking about for the collective? We got the hangman, yeah, waiting, waiting on stability, um, it's coming, cause we got the four ones at the bottom of the deck, that's like, you know, happy home life, peace, so it's coming, just be patient, it's coming for the collective that is worried about money. Clarify the King of Pentacles for the collective. Uh, we got the Devil. The Devil with the King of Pentacles. Hmm. Um. Yeah, maybe some of y'all in the collective is being... Maybe y'all obsessing over some money. It's coming. You just have to be patient, y'all. It's really coming. We got the page of the pen. We got page of pinnacles at the at the bottom of the deck. Then we got the star. Yeah, have have faith and hope that it's coming. It's coming. You don't have to be obsessive over it. Clarify the four swords for the collective. We got the lovers. Hmm. Okay, and some some other people in the collective could be waiting on a relationship, waiting on union, love, because the love is, is, you know, about love, and it's also about making choices in life. So some of some people in the collective could be, um, being patient on love or waiting for love or just. You know, or need to take a break from love. I don't know. 
We got the Wheel of Fortune at the bottom of the deck. Can I get more insights on the four swords and the lovers for the collector? We got the nine of cups. Yeah. Some some of y'all in the collector was really waiting for love. It's coming because we got the ace of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Love is coming y'all way. You just have to be patient. Keep focusing on yourselves. It's coming. Um, what is the king? What more insights on the king of pentacles and the devil? Ten of wands. Eight of cups. Hmm. Let me look at the Ten of Wands for y'all in the book. Yeah, the Ten of Wands is a sign of burden and responsibility. Being dependent on it is a good thing, but be aware of being overworked. Yeah, some of pe some people in the collective is too worried about money right now. Like, <laughs> oh my God, yeah. I understand what y'all going through because y'all have responsibilities. Y'all have responsibilities, so y'all need the money now. But you don't have to be obsessive over it. It's money. It's coming. We got the Eight of Cups, Justice, and the Wheel of Fortune, Ten of Swords. I don't know what this about. More insight for the collector for the Knights of Pentacles and the Hanging. The Three of Cups in Reverse. And the Two of Wands. Okay, we got the Three of Cups in Reverse. Okay, that could be about gossip. Gossip. Um, someone messing around on somebody or something. I don't know what this, I don't know. Like, uh, Knight of Pentacles, the Hangman, and the Three of Cups in reverse. Like, okay. I just heard that some somebody is going to tell y'all, somebody in the collective, someone is going to tell y'all or whoever is going through this right now that your girlfriend or boyfriend is messing around on you or something, got a third party or something, and you will get some insight in on it. Yeah. Got the two of ones at the bottom of the deck. It might not have it might not have happened yet, but it might. I don't know. Okay, what's the overall energy for the collector for the Knights of Pentacles, the Hangman, and the Three of Cups in reverse? For whoever going through this situation. What's the overall energy? Justice. Yep. Yep. Somebody is going to find out. 
somebody's finna find out about a third party. They boyfriend or they girlfriend is messing around with somebody. I don't know. But it's a lot of gossip going on about it. And somebody tipped you off about it. You will get your justice. You will get to your justice. It's long overdue. You've been waiting for this. Somebody in the collective knew they boyfriend or they girlfriend were messing around on them. And you just gonna you just gonna end it. You're gonna let it go. You 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 just gonna move on. Yeah. After, behind the, the death card, we got the moon. Secrets, unknown things. You, you just gonna move on from it. You tired of the secrets. You tired of lies. It's like everything coming coming together now. The page of cuts. The king of swords. That's intelligence. So. You already knew. You just needed the answers. For whoever that is. For the collective. For whoever. Who, somebody's going through this in the collective. It could be for anybody. I don't know. It's a general reading. So, take what, you know, resonate with you. Okay. Spirit, what's the overall energy for the collective, whoever going through in this pile? The King of Pentacles, the Devil, and the Ten of Wands. We got the Two of Wands in reverse. Um, I guess, yeah, somebody is not going to listen to this. Because they overwhelmed, they overwalked, they need money, they obsessing over it. So they not they not gonna listen. They not gonna listen. They I don't. I, it low key I, this low key look kind of bad though. Cause we got we got the the King of Pentacles and the Devil. I just hope nobody gonna. I just hope nobody in the collective gonna do anything bad to get the get to get some money. Okay, it's not that serious. I mean, honest, it is serious, but you don't you don't have to do e illegal stuff to get some money. We got temperance. We got temperance can stand for patience, balance, or. Somebody, somebody that's a, somebody that you trust trying to tell you this, trying to tell you this, but you're not listening because you need it now because you have responsibilities, and I understand that. But just don't don't do nothing really bad. Like don't be trying to don't no don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Whatever it is, it's not a it's not a good choice. It's really not. Okay, what's the overall energy for whoever going through this in this pile for the collective? The four of swords, the lovers, and the nine of cups. The overall energy. The moon. So, unknown secrets. Hmm. So the four of swords, the lovers, and the nine of cups. I can look at this two ways. I can look at it either as somebody is being patient, waiting on a relationship that will bring them wish, sass, wish, you know, wish fulfillment, but the moon came out. That's like unknown secrets dreams like you don't know when it's gonna happen or something and the other way i'm looking at it is somebody is resting or contemplating on how to break up a relationship that's like it's like it's together like ain't no you can't break this and and they want to get rich fulfillment out of this and it's a secret. Nobody knows about it. So I don't really know. Um, this is a collective message. So I really don't know. I really don't know.
take what resonates with you and what doesn't. But that's what I feel for right now that's going on in the collective. And at the bottom of the deck, we got the King of Swords. And that basically is lose your mind. Whoever in the collective, just, you know, lose your mind. Don't do anything dumb or stupid or try to be afraid nobody or hurt nobody. Because I got the Eight of Swords, at the, you know, after the King of Swords. Like, yeah, this just don't look good. I don't know. Okay, I'm going to lose my oracles for right. I'm going to lose my oracles right quick. Okay, give me an oracle message for the collector for the Knights of Pentacles, the Hangman, Three of Cups in Reverse, and Justice. We got incubation, but it was in reverse. Incubation means something is brewing or baking or something, but it's in reverse. Then we got intentions, and that's in reverse too, so. Yeah, whoever going through this with the third party, the girlfriend or the boyfriend, whoever this is in the collective, um, the boyfriend or girlfriend probably don't want to be in the relationship no more. So he, so he or she is doing stupid stuff. That's their attention. They want you to break up with them. They don't want to be in this relationship. They don't want to break up. They don't. They don't want to be with whoever this is in the collective. And but you would get justice from this though. You will get justice. Whoever going through this, if they boy, whoever going through a situation where they boyfriend messing around with them, they girlfriend messing around with them, don't want to be with them, and trying to make you break up with them or want this to happen, it's okay. You still gonna get your justice. You gonna get it. So stop worrying. Then we got responsibilities and remembrance for that. Okay. Give me an oracle for this pile for the King of Pentacles, the Devil, the Ten of Wands, and the Two of Wands in reverse. We got respect. Yeah, so. Whoever is trying to do something illegal to get some money, just respect, you know, the people, whatever, whatever you're trying to do, just respect yourself or respect the, whoever, whatever you're trying to do, just respect yourself, okay? Just respect yourself. It's a like passion and cleansing. I don't know. Okay, for whoever going through this in this message, um, what oracle cards do they need for whoever going through in this message? The Four of Swords, the Lovers, Nine of Cups, and the Moon. We got fulfillment. We got fulfillment. So. We got cleansing and passion again. So fulfillment is, yeah, whoever writing on a relationship, it's going to be a good fulfillment for you or for whoever going, whoever looking for, you know, whoever won't love or waiting on a relationship, it's going to be a fulfillment for you. Just be patient. We got the moon card. It might take a month. It might take a month. But the fulfillment card ain't giving me nothing bad, so I don't think, so I don't think it was that other option that I had. Maybe it was the first one when somebody looking for love or somebody with a soulmate or something. It's gonna be a fulfillment. Um, and I'm gonna do affirmations for each pile. Give me an um, affirmation for the collective. Give me three affirmations for the collective. Before I end this. So what we got is. Energy flows where my intentions go. 
Yeah. Just have good intentions for whatever whatever, whatever y'all doing, the collective, whatever y'all doing. Just make sure y'all intentions is good and it's just good and you lose common sense. Because when you do that, then you, you know, energy going to flow. You going to get what you want. Then we got, there's nothing sexier than my authentic truth. Exactly. Just be true to yourselves. Just be true to yourselves. The collective. Then the last one we got is joy is the ultimate creator. Yes, just be grateful for the things y'all have. Stop worrying. Everything is going to be okay. And last but, last but not least, and I'll be done, is give me three self-care cards for the collective. Self-care. Okay. One more, please. All right. We got connect. We got connect with your ancestors. So some people in the collective should start connecting more with their ancestors. We got make a meal. Um, make the collective need to like make a health. You know, a good meal for them. A comfortable meal. You know. To, in, to be grateful for. And then we have make an altar. So some in the collective should start making an altar to dedicate to their ancestors. Because their ancestors need, want to talk to them. Okay. But well, that was my collective message for today. I hope y'all enjoy. My name is Ty, but my YouTube channel is going to be called Thug Angel. And the thug stands for the hate you gave angel. So, I mean, yeah. Y'all will see more of me, though. Uh, I'm going to, you know, this is my first video, so... Y'all gonna get to know me, like I'm gonna get to know y'all, so. Bye, y'all.